might as well just do some brakes on the caravan chassis. So I've already gone ahead with a die grinder. Got rid of the lip. Scuffed up the surface a little bit. inside there with the washer so that the washer is part of the nut so otherwise if the washer wasn't there it would the nut would just compress on the race and not spread the spread the pressure equally across the surface to get a decent clamp it force on the burn to make sure it's tight. should have an axle stand underneath but why it's just a, a bit of chassis we're okay but I advise you use an axle stand if you're gonna do this just people don't get hurt hello um I'm gonna put new wheel bearings in this um, in the drums for the uh, trailer so I just took the lip out of the disc, out of the drum, sorry, scuff the surface up. So now we can pop the seal up. Just have to clamp that in place because we'll be reusing the seal. Seal, but that'll be okay because we can just place that back in. There's bearing, put that to one side. That'll be cleaning up. I've uh, got some new bearings for it. the grease out. Or at least most of the grease out. So when I first took, got the drums, there's no notch in them to where you knock it out. It's just ever so slightly oh, the ridge of the uh, race you can just knock out. So I'll piece the video together and uh, show you. Right, so the old race have been knocked out, new races put in. There's the old races. Um, rear bearings, pack of grease, seal cleaned up, knocked in. So you want your seal to be flush as you can. You see the chamfer where it's shiny, so you want it to just be flush where it comes to the bottom of that. By a little bit past it, depending on how much room there is between the seal and the bearing.
yet to do the, the front bearing but packing bearings is um, pushing the grease inside the needle rollers and getting rid of where it just spins free the where there's a bit of resistance in the rollers um, it just feels stiffer to turn when you put grease in them um, and you keep pressing grease in the back there between the rollers and it will end up coming through out the cage there and then you press it in in front of the bearing um, and then it will come out the front of the cage there and then press some in the centres of the rollers to pack it out that's it really um, so I've cleaned the lip up of the drum scuff the surface up get rid of the shine out of it um, clean the shoes up with some uh, emery cloth um, right thanks for watching